This is right clavicle. Anterior, posterior, medial and lateral. Therefore, this is the medial end or the sternal end of the clavicle. This is the lateral or the acromial end of the clavicle. This is the superior surface. And the superior surface is smooth. The medial two-thirds of the clavicle is convex to the anterior side. If you look at the medial end or the sternal end, it's rounded and wide. The lateral end, on the other hand, is flat. Medial half has an anterior surface and a posterior surface. And the lateral half has an anterior border and a posterior border. This is the inferior surface. Inferior surface is rough compared to the superior surface because of attachment of a muscle and two ligaments. Here you can see the tuberosity for costoclavicular ligament. This area is the groove for subclavius muscle. This is conoid tubercle. Corococlavicular ligament is attached to the conoid tubercle. Corococlavicular ligament is a very strong ligament. It is stronger than the bone itself. When there is a sudden force applied to the bone, bone rather than the ligament breaks. And when the bone breaks, usually it is at the junction between the middle one-third and the lateral one-third here, which is just medial to the attachment of the coracoclavicular ligament.